Mr. Yeah. Speaker, many constituents, especially those emanating from the Punjab and other parts of India, and I were horrified to see footage of water cannon, tear gas and brute force being used against peacefully protesting farmers. However, it was heartwarming to see those very farmers feeding those forces who had been ordered to beat or suppress them. What indomitable spirit, and it takes a special kind of people to do that. So will the Prime Minister convey to the Indian Prime Minister our heartfelt anxieties, our hopes for a speedy resolution to the current deadlock, and does he agree that everyone has a fundamental right to peaceful protest? Of course, Mr Speaker, and uh, uh, our, our views that the, the right honourable gentleman knows, uh, as the honourable gentleman knows, uh, well, uh, is of course that uh, we have serious concerns about uh, what is happening uh, in, in, between India and, and Pakistan, but these are preeminently matters uh, for those two governments to settle, and I, and I know that he appreciates that point.